guys, so today I will be doing another tag video for Tag Friday. And today's tag will be the Rip It or Ship It tag. This tag was started by Emma Books on YouTube. And basically, the object of this tag, you draw from two cups. One has boy character names in them and the other one is girls and these are all filled with like fictional book characters and so you pick a name out of each cup and with the two names you choose you have to choose whether you rip it or ship it and shipping it means that you like those two characters as a couple you want to see them grow old and get married together and all of that and ripping it means that you do not support that couple you want them to go away and so you rip their names up stuff like that so that is what I'm going to be doing today I made separate cups of boys and girls characters you could combine them together but I prefer doing it this way um, yeah so let's get started with this tag I'm really really excited for it okay so round one I'm going to pick from the boys cup first these papers are really stuck together, but I have one. And then next is the girls. And so for the boy character, I have <laughs> my favorite character ever, Kyo Soma from Fruits Basket. And for the girl character, I have what are the odds? Oh my goodness, are you kidding me? Toru Honda from Fruits Basket. Yes, of course I ship this. Oh my goodness, that's so funny. I didn't ever think I was going to get two characters from the same world, but I did. That is so weird. But yes, I do ship these two together so bad, like so bad it hurts. Oh my goodness, yes. Automatic ship, they are like my favorite couple in manga, in books, in anime ever. That is still happening. So yes, I do ship that one. Okay, and for round two, let's shake them up a little more. I will be picking from the boys' cup. Man, they're like sticky notes, so they're like really stuck together. And now from the girls' cup. So the boy character is Dorian from Throne of Glass. And the girl character is Laura Jean from <laughs> To All the Boys I've Loved Before. Let me think about this one. Well, first of all, they're from totally different social groups because Dorian is a prince and Laura Jean is like a nobody girl. <laughs> um, I don't really know about this one. I guess it could work because I mean they kind of have similar personalities. They both are kind of big flirts I guess. Um, so they might get along really well so why not? I will ship that. And here we go with round three. And we have Jacob from Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children. And for the girl, we have, oh my gosh, Selena from Throne of Glass. Um, that one's ki kind of weird. I don't know if I do ship that one because I think they yeah. have really, really polar yeah. opposite personalities. I mean, sometimes opposites attract, but Jacob is kind of very timid. And stuff and Selena's like obviously an assa assassin um, so she's a lot bolder than Jacob and I don't know if they'd really get along really well so I am going to rip that so we're on round four and picking from the boy side and now the girl side so we have Greg from Me and Earl and the Dying Girl. And for the girl, we have Hazel Grace Lancaster from The Fault in Our Stars. Um, well, they're both from contemporary books, so that's a thing they have in common. I don't really know. I have to think about this one. Well, Greg doesn't really like girls in general, so putting him in this tag is kind of an automatic rip because he doesn't really like relationships so I don't know I think I will not ship that because I don't know if Hazel would particularly get along with him and I don't think Greg would really be fond of her either so that one will be ripped. <laughs> 
so we are on round five. So we have Miles from Looking for Alaska and Harper from the Rebel Bell. I'm getting weird couples for this tag. I don't I don't really know what to think of these two in particular. You know what? Since Miles is someone who is really into the very adventurous girl because Alaska is obviously pretty adventurous and out there and Harper is someone who has supernatural powers so she is all about adventure and stuff I think they would make a really good couple so I am going to ship that I think that would really work you know what forget that let's pick from the girls first because they haven't got any chance to be picked first okay so we have Feyre from A Court of Thorns and Roses and for the boy we have <laughs> Again, it's Hamlin from A Court of Thorns and Roses. Again, from the same book. That is so weird that that happened twice. What are the odds? But yes, I do ship these two together. Really, really do. I love the chemistry they have together. They're just an amazing couple to me. So there's no doubt about it. I am shipping those two. They, I ship them very, very hard. So we are on round. I don't even remember anymore don't remember wrong round something and I just dropped a name okay, so we have David from Rebel Bell and Haruhi from Oran High School House Club yeah that is a very very odd pairing but you know what now that I think about it their personalities really are alike because David is arrogant really really is and um, very straightforward and Haruhi is very very straightforward too I think they would actually really really work together so I'm gonna ship that even though I don't know they kind of make an odd couple appearance wise but I think their personalities really go well together okay so we have Sam from the Gone series and for the girl we have Katniss from the Hunger Games could work that could actually really really work because they are like natural leaders like Sam is the leader of a whole town basically and Katniss leads basically the whole world I think if they work together it would be it would work really really well actually I really do like this ship so I am going to ship that I think it could so work yeah like this one okay so again picking from the boys first I don't know what round I'm on, but it'll stay on the screen somewhere, obviously. So we have Tamaki from Oran High School Host Club. I love that character. And for the girl, we have <laughs> Laia from The Kiss of Deception. This is so weird because I was thinking, like, if I possibly picked this ship, I was thinking in my head, like, would that work? And I actually came up with the conclusion that it could work because um, Tamaki is very very rich and Laia is or Leah I don't really know how to pronounce her name is from royalty she's a princess so because they're kind of in the same social classes I think they could work so I am going to ship those two really really like that ship um, I don't know exactly how well their personalities would clash together because Tomaki is very, very boastful and full of himself and why it's kind of reserved, but I still think it could work out. So I like that one for sure. Yeah, I definitely made more boys character than girls character. Oops. <laughs> and I only have one girl character left. And so we have, let me see open paper Pita from the Hunger Games and Emma from Miss Tara Green's Home for Peculiar Children um that one's really really weird I don't think I'm gonna ship that one because their personalities don't go together and I don't know I just don't picture it at all so that one is rich and so that is almost it but before I finish, I have been seeing people do this in this tag. They will pick 
draw out of the cup and whatever person they get gets shipped with them. I like that idea, so I'm going to do that. So let's see who I get shipped with. I have three boy characters named in here. So let's pick from those. Shake them up really well. Okay, so the boy I will be shipped with is... <laughs> I like this one a lot. Kale from Throne of Glass. I adore Kale so much. Um, really, he's kind of one of my favorite characters in the series right now. I'm on the first book and I'm really, really liking him. So yes, I ship this. Um, I don't know, he might be kind of annoyed with me because I'm not, I don't know. I don't know if you like me, but I like him, so I shipped this pairing right here, definitely. And that completes the tag. I had a lot of fun with this. I definitely will tag anyone who wants to do it. It was really, really fun, and I'd recommend doing it. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye.